Ever since we humans started looking into space with telescopes, we have been discovering strange things. The first astronomers were amazed at the size of Jupiter or Saturn's rings. In the meantime, we look with super telescopes more than 13 billion light years deep into space. We know of countless galaxies, trillions of stars and planets, and yet researchers continue to discover objects that defy all previously known scientific sizes. 10 such unexplainable and fascinating objects in space we present to you in this video. But before we start with this list, we would like to ask for a contribution. Please leave us a comment after the video, appropriate to the topic, and make sure that your contribution represents a real added value for all viewers. From now on, our subscribers will always receive a heart and will pin your important contribution at the top so that everyone can read it first. Just make sure you've already subscribed, like the video, and mention both at the beginning of your comment. HD 8606b HD 8606b is an exoplanet in a binary star system, and it's one of the planets with the longest orbit. HD 8606b orbits its star not only in an incredibly long orbit, but also in an oblique orbit. In practice, this means that the exoplanet periodically comes very close to its star, only to move very, very far away from it again. On the planet, this orbit leads to an inferno that we can hardly imagine with terrestrial scales. HD 8606b spends most of its time at a distance of up to 127.1 million kilometers from its star. During this time, the planet is almost in darkness and the temperatures are accordingly icy. Every 111 days, the planet comes within 4.5 million kilometers of its star. And during this time, this world heats up enormously. What was previously frozen and icy then begins to burn and glow. The enormous temperature differences make these planets a hot, cold hell, and presumably the energy creates storms with winds of over 702 kilometers per hour. PSR J1719-1438 PSR J1719-1438 is a neutron star that puzzles researchers. The remnant of a dead star is extremely massive, yet surprisingly small. With a mass that is 1.4 times that of our Earth, they are just 20 kilometers across. A teaspoon of the mass of PSR J1719-1438 would weigh about 1 billion tons on Earth. But the really curious thing about this pulsar is its companion, PSR J1719-1438b, at first appeared to be an exoplanet that survived the death of its star. But then researchers came up with a very different, almost spooky result. Presumably, the Jupiter-sized apparition is the remnant of a star whose outer layers were sucked out by the more massive pulsar. The planet is now mostly carbon, and that's what's super exciting, because calculations have shown that exoplanet 1438b's high density could make it a giant diamond. Orcs Cosmic orcs are not man-eating monsters from fantasy worlds, but mysterious objects of gigantic proportions. Orc in astronomy stands for odd radio circle, and so far only four such phenomena are known. The radio and light wave emitting entities exceed the diameter of our Milky Way galaxy by up to 50,000 times. The parts are circular and brighter in the interior than at the edge. Fascinatingly, three of these known orcs contain galaxies. Whether this is the case with all orcs could not be clarified so far. Possibly the galaxies inside the orcs produce this halo-like appearance. These cosmic oddities were discovered with the Array Radio Telescope in Australia. White Dwarf ZTF J1901 plus 1458 ZTF J1901 plus 1458 
is a white dwarf located 130 light years from Earth. With a diameter of just 4,300 kilometers, this star is only 800 kilometers larger than our Moon. Yet, ZTF J1901 1458 has a mass that exceeds our Sun by 35 times. We make the teaspoon comparison again. One teaspoon of the mass of this star weighs a little more than a full-grown bull elephant. This makes ZTF J1901 1458 the most massive white dwarf known. This massive, tiny star was discovered by Caltech's Palomar Observatory in California. White dwarfs are very old stars that fall roughly in the size category of our Sun. They have reached the final stage of their evolution, nuclear fusion has ceased, and their nuclear energy supply is nearly exhausted. Our Sun will also eventually become a white dwarf, as will about 97% of the currently known stars. Tabby Star 1,470 light-years from Earth, researchers found a star exhibiting strange dimming patterns in its light emission. The patterns cannot be explained by any known cosmic phenomenon, nor can passing exoplanets be responsible. KIC 8462852 posed a mystery to scientists. The oddball became known among experts as Tabby's star because it was discovered by an astronomer named Tabitha Boyajin. Some researchers speculated that Tabby's star could provide evidence of an alien civilization's power generation network. According to the Kardashev scale, level 3 civilizations use giant networks around their star as energy providers. This thesis was quickly discarded in conservative scientific circles, and a reasonable explanation, such as large amounts of extremely fine dust, were agreed upon. Proven or computationally comprehensible is this rational explanation approach so far, however not. In plain language, this means that the alien power plant is still in the realm of possibility. HD 14283 HD 14283 is a star which should not exist. The object in the constellation Libra brought it with measurements with the Hubble Space Telescope to an age of 16 billion years. Well, you'll probably think now, does that mean something before the Big Bang 13.8 billion years ago? How can that be then? Researchers naturally also ask themselves this. HD 14283, which got the nickname Methuselah, occupied science for years. Astronomers calculated back and forth and announced some months later a corrected age of 14.3 billion years. Already better, but still somehow impossible. So, one calculated further and already new results, which were more pleasing, came to daylight. Methuselah should be suddenly only something more than 12 billion years old. In 2022, finally James Webb discovered whole galaxies which are far older than the Big Bang Theory would permit. Here too, researchers are currently trying to straighten everything out, but so far, without success. The mass of the ancient star accumulations speaks slowly for the fact that the universe is nevertheless substantially older than assumed so far. The confusing age determination around the Methuselah star appear since then, also again in a completely different light. HD 53143 just 60 light years away from us is the star HD 53143. The stellar youngster is about 1 billion years old and 80 times bigger as well as 70 times brighter than the Sun. Because of its young age, this star still has around it the remnants of the dust disk from which it was formed. For astronomers, this is a unique possibility to draw conclusions about the early days of our own star system because exoplanets may develop from the dust disk within the further course. During the close observation of HD 53143, however, researchers found something that did not fit into the picture. In the outer circular disk, there was a second one, in the shape of an ellipse, which is also slightly shifted against the outer disk. Normally, the larger disk should not have swallowed the smaller one long ago 
except an exoplanet inside the disk prevents this. If this is the case, HD 53143 would be again an object which contradicts all logic. V Hydrae V Hydrae is at first a normal carbon star of the stellar class C91. Only at a closer look, the unusual thing about this star becomes obvious. It produces monstrous plasma bubbles, which fly away from the star at enormous speeds. The projectiles are about 9400 degrees hot and twice as big as Mars. The speed of the plasma bombs is so great that they would travel the distance between the Earth and the Moon in 30 minutes. The first plasma bomb from this system was observed in 1986, and since then others have followed at nearly regular intervals of eight and a half years each. WASP 107b Who is the fluffiest planet in the entire cosmos? Well, WASP 107b. This star, which is about the size of Jupiter, has the density of cotton candy. By comparison, our Jupiter is 300 times more massive than Earth. Thus, WASP-107b is the thinnest, lightest, and fluffiest exoplanet known so far, and a real wonder of science. NGC 1052-DF2 If we look into space, we might think that curiosities and oddities are much more common than normal and predictable phenomena. The list of objects that do not fit into the logic of earthly scientists is endless and every day new discoveries are made. As if the researchers had not already enough riddles to solve, now also still new galaxies appear, in which there is as good as no dark matter. As a reminder, in the rest of the cosmos, mysterious dark matter very likely accounts for 85% of all mass. The difficult thing about this type of matter is that it cannot absorb, reflect, or emit light. That means we can't see it or measure it, but we can observe its effects on the gravity of objects made of normal matter. Discovered in 2018 by astronomers from Amsterdam, the galaxy NGC 1052 DF2 contains hardly any stars and is correspondingly poor in luminosity. This once again corroborates that the dark force is directly linked to the appearance of normal matter. Where there is no dark matter, there are no stars, so it looks so far at any rate. As crazy as our universe is, even this logic could soon be overthrown. NGC 1052 DF2 is not only conspicuous by its star poverty, but also by its relatively chaotic state of order. Compared to a beautiful spiral galaxy, NGC 1052 DF2 appears like an unsorted collection of stars. This naturally leads to the conclusion that dark matter is also involved in the formation of the order states and shapes in the cosmos. This list of curiosities in the universe could be continued for hours now, and we would have shown you only a small part of what is possible in our cosmos. Tell us now what you think about these discoveries of NASA and what conclusion you draw from phenomena like these. We welcome your opinions and contributions on the topic. Remember to mention that you've subscribed and to like the video. We're glad you joined us today and we'll see you next time on Simply Space.